So this is my laptop gaming setup and it is kind of a budget setup since it does cost less than a thousand dollars. So starting off we have the laptop, it is the Acer Nitro 5, the 2020 edition. It is a 60 hertz laptop with a GTX 1650 and an i5-9300H. I do everything on this laptop like recording and editing and this is also a amazing laptop for many Many games it costs only six hundred dollars and it can run most games at around 80 fps now under my laptop i have a very cheap five dollar laptop stand and i had it for over a year now and it's really really helpful since it cools down your laptop so it doesn't really overheat too much i suggest people with laptops to definitely get a laptop cooler since it's really really helpful now next thing is my keyboard. This is the Asus Rogue Strix TKL. It has red switches and it is amazing because of how fast these switches are. Moving on, we have my mouse. This is the Razer Viper Mini. I'm planning on upgrading my mouse, but this mouse will do for now. I did have some problems with the scroll wheel, but I fixed it. But overall, this mouse is amazing. The glide, you know, really, really well. It's very, very small for people who want this mouse. So if you have big hands, it's honestly just gonna be very uncomfortable. Now over here is my mic. I use this mic for all my videos. So whenever you guys hear me talking, it is using this mic. This is the Fifine K699B, I believe. And it's a really, really good mic for around $70. It has a tap to mute, a lot of features. It's very, very similar to the Shure SM7B, but it's way cheaper. It's a really, really good mic if you're on somewhat of a budget. Next thing is my mouse pad. This thing is huge. As you guys can see, it almost covers up my entire desk and my desk is already pretty huge. This mouse pad is by the mouse pad company and they use a different material on their mouse pad compared to different mouse pads. And it's just amazing. Glide is amazing. You know, I had this thing for almost a year and there's like no problems with it whatsoever. My headset is the Turo Beach Elite Pro 2, I believe. This thing is super, super comfortable and it's honestly just amazing headset. I have it connected to the super amp so I can customize the volume, presets, all that stuff through my phone. I had it for around six months, no problems whatsoever. The sound is amazing. And in COD, I could literally hear kids from like a building away. That's how good this headphone is. All these wires are ran into my laptop and I do have a USB port over here since there's only three USB ports from this laptop and I'm using around five USBs, I believe. So I had to get a USB port for that. Over here, I just have a regular simple mouse bungee. Had this for a long time, no problems whatsoever. Super, super cheap, I think around like ten dollars or something like that really really good mouse bungee and it just gets the job on my desk i have two plants one of them is fake which is this one this one's from ikea and then this plant is actually real i water this every day so it doesn't die you know real plant fake plant just gives it a pretty nice aesthetic to the desk now i do have some lights over here around my setup over here i have the govi wall light it just goes down on my desk, as you guys can see, it just goes down. It has like a triangular shape. Really, really nice light. I have it on a rainbow DIY preset right now. So it's just really, really cool. And then on top, I have my nano leaves. I made this design that covers on my YouTube play button. But yeah, setting up these nano leaves took me so long. I don't even want to talk about how many times these nano leaves literally fell while I was sleeping. And I literally woke up because of it. Honestly, an overkill, but if you want to get nano leaves, this is definitely worth it. 